It has been a long time since NASA's James Webb Telescope gave us a staggering first look at the depths of our universe. When we imagine life on different planets, we have to imagine the climate on those planets too. This is the first time we get to orbit Mercury, and the James Webb Telescope just revealed the terrifying secret that NASA has kept hidden about Mercury, and it's disturbing. This little planet is concealing some exceptionally unnerving things. Right next to the very hot sun, Mercury hides shining treasures that no one thought it would have. Moreover, Mercury's core remains a huge mystery, with scientists picking up strange signals from it that don't appear anywhere else in our planetary system. What terrifying secrets might Mercury be keeping? Let's explore the strange facts that Mercury is attempting to conceal. Some cool things are being kept secret by Mercury, the little planet close to the Sun. For a long time, we didn't know much about it, despite its size and extreme heat. However, recent space missions have revealed things we didn't expect. Among other things, experts believe they may have found diamonds on this hot planet. That's not all, though, Mercury's interior is stranger and more massive than we imagined. Scientists have discovered that a thick layer of diamonds might exist many miles beneath Mercury's surface. So, what secrets lie hidden beneath? The newest findings are about to be made public, and space enthusiasts have always been fascinated by the smallest planet in our solar system. Mercury's landscape remained a mystery for a long time, as nobody could see it. We didn't start to piece together our understanding of space until we got better at it. Mariner 10 was the first space probe to visit Mercury, offering our initial good look at this little planet. It approached closely, taking images of a cratered surface with unusual lines that looked like the moon. The mission revealed a rugged surface with numerous craters and a surprisingly strong magnetic field. Additionally, its core turned out to be larger than scientists had previously thought. These findings challenged our assumptions about the structure of the planet. The Messenger spacecraft spent a long time orbiting Mercury, unlike its predecessor Mariner 10, which only visited briefly. This allowed for a more thorough exploration. Messenger captured an astounding 200,000 images, revealing parts of Mercury previously hidden from humans. Among the many discoveries was the high concentration of calcium and magnesium on Mercury's darker side, leading researchers to ponder what natural processes could have caused this phenomenon. It was also observed that Mercury's magnetic field is strongest in its northern regions, something not seen on any other planet in our solar system. These findings not only helped us learn more but also challenged our understanding of planetary science. Scientists had to reevaluate what they thought they knew about Mercury's composition and formation. Most planets have magnetic fields generated by liquid iron moving within their cores, but Mercury's magnetic properties differ due to its internal organization. Mercury isn't just craters and a strange magnetic field, either. Conditions on the surface are harsh. It can reach 800 degrees Fahrenheit during the day, hot enough to melt lead. However, temperatures drop quickly at night, creating a dramatic temperature swing. With these insights, the significant temperature variations highlight that Mercury is not a simple planet. We continue to study it because it challenges our understanding of planetary systems. Mercury has an extremely thin atmosphere, which does little to stabilize its temperature or retain heat. Consequently, it can get as cold as minus 300 degrees Fahrenheit. Despite these harsh conditions, recent studies have revealed intriguing features on Mercury's surface. In 2012, Data from the Messenger spacecraft indicated that Mercury may not be as geologically inactive as previously thought. Signs of ancient volcanic activity were found, suggesting that Mercury has been more dynamic than we imagined. Then, in 2020, scientists discovered something else surprising. Patches of water ice in craters at the poles. These craters, located in areas that never receive direct sunlight, remain cold enough to keep ice frozen. This discovery has sparked curiosity about potential life in these icy regions, especially microscopic organisms capable of surviving extreme conditions. It's time to learn more about a world that operates by its own rules, starting with its unique day and year cycles. Baby Colombo, a mission launched by the European Space Agency and the Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency in 2018, 
is scheduled to arrive at Mercury in 2025 to study the planet's surface, chemical composition, and geological history. Even more surprises await, such as Mercury's surprisingly strong magnetic field and the presence of water ice. Another oddity is that Mercury's year is shorter than its day, despite being so close to the Sun. How is that possible? Generally, we think of planets orbiting the Sun once a year and rotating once per day. Mercury doesn't follow this pattern. Its year is only 88 days long, whereas its day lasts twice as long. Mercury's slow rotation combined with its fast orbit creates a peculiar effect. The Sun would rise, grow larger, appear to pause, and even move backward briefly before continuing its path across the sky. Mercury's unusual movement is due to tidal locking, which has gradually slowed its rotation over billions of years. While Earth's moon is fully locked, with one side constantly facing Earth, Mercury's rotation is only partially synchronized with its orbit. Its days are much longer than its years due to this odd rotational pattern. Mercury is thus caught in a unique position, with one side facing Earth every other orbit. It completes three rotations for every two orbits around the Sun, a phenomenon known as a 3 2 spin orbit resonance. The surface of the item is extremely unforgiving because, due to this, one side is consistently pointing toward the Sun and gets exceptionally warm, while the opposite side is always in darkness and gets freezing. Probably the greatest temperature changes in our entire solar system happen this way. Getting to know Mercury's secret cavities, it doesn't have much of an atmosphere. Many people consider it an exosphere since it's so thin, with gases continuously escaping into space from this exosphere. These include the solar wind, radioactive particles breaking down, and tiny meteoroids striking the surface and taking their place. Some amazing new facts about the exosphere have been discovered. For instance, in 2020, data from the MESSENGER spacecraft showed a surprising amount of water vapor in the air. Scientists believe this water vapor is formed when hydrogen from the solar wind combines with oxygen in the rocks on Mercury's surface. Mercury's magnetic field is influenced by its slow rotation and rapid revolution. It has a global magnetic field, even though it's small and spins slowly. This field is thought to originate from a dynamo process in its liquid metal core. The odd orbit and rotation shape this interaction. The magnetic field is still vital, even though it's not as strong as Earth's. It protects the planet from the intense solar wind. If this magnetic shield weren't there, the solar wind would quickly remove what little oxygen exists. Mercury is also fascinating because it twists and moves around the sun. Some areas on its surface, known as hot poles, seem to make the sun appear to stop in the sky at certain times, making those spots very hot. Conversely, some places near the poles are always dark and never see the sun researchers were astonished to find water ice in these dark spots. The ice remains frozen because these regions are shielded from sunlight, keeping them cold despite the rest of the area being extremely hot. When scientists discovered this, they speculated that these cold, dark spots might contain other materials, perhaps even organic compounds. Exploring Mercury is challenging. Sending spacecraft is difficult due to Mercury's rapid orbit around the Sun mission plans must be meticulously calculated, often requiring spacecraft to fly by Venus and Mercury multiple times to slow down enough to enter orbit. Mercury's fast movement through space requires spacecraft to make these precise maneuvers, using the gravity of other planets to adjust its speed and trajectory. The Baby Columbo mission is currently en route to Mercury. Launched in 2018, it will begin orbiting Mercury in 2025 after nine flybys around other planets. Once it arrives, Baby Columbo will have to contend with Mercury's unusual day-night cycle, carefully monitoring its temperature from the sun and keeping all its systems operational during the long, cold nights. Balancing these conditions is crucial for the mission, especially since Mercury's unique rotation and orbit make it a challenging environment. Recently, new computer models have given us a better understanding of how fast Mercury is moving. These models indicate that it may have spun much faster in the past, but its rotation slowed due to the Sun's gravity and impacts from asteroids and comets. These insights help us learn about Mercury's past and hint at how other worlds in our solar system evolved over time. But wait, there's more. As scientists learn more about Mercury, they uncover new questions. 
They want to understand how Mercury's unusual orbit affects its surface and how its core remains partially liquid despite the long, cold nights. These questions reveal how much we still have to learn about the Sun and how it functions. Mercury's unique features challenge our understanding of planet formation and evolution, pushing us to test scientific theories and develop new ideas. And there may be more wonders hidden beneath its cratered surface. Mercury is the smallest planet in our solar system, but it holds a lot of fascinating features within its small size. Scientists are constantly surprised by it, its unique characteristics and discoveries. One of the most intriguing things about Mercury is that its core is much larger than previously thought. A study led by planetary scientist Dr. Nancy Chabot at the Johns Hopkins Applied Physics Lab found that the core makes up around 85% of the planet. In comparison, Earth's core is only about 15% of its volume, so this is significantly larger. One theory is that Mercury might have been a much larger planet in the past, but a massive collision early in the solar system's history may have destroyed much of its outer layers. The College of Arizona's Dr. Eric Asag calls this thought the quick in and out situation. It suggests that an enormous asteroid might have collided with Mercury, eliminating a great deal of its mantle and hull, and leaving behind the iron-rich core we see today. However, this wasn't the only unusual thing scientists found about Mercury. It also has an extremely strong magnetic field, unlike Venus, which has none. Mercury's magnetic field is around 1% as strong as Earth's, making the little planet's nature significantly more intriguing. NASA's MESSENGER mission discovered something surprising about Mercury's magnetic field. The scientist Dr. Katherine Johnson and her team from the University of British Columbia found that Mercury's magnetic field isn't centered within the planet. Instead, it is offset by about 20% of the planet's radius. This may be due to differences in rock density, which affects heat movement beneath Mercury's surface. In 2020, sulfur, potassium, and sodium were found on Mercury's surface, an unexpected discovery since these elements would typically burn off in high-temperature environments near the sun Dr. Patrick Peplowski of the Johns Hopkins Applied Physics Laboratory suggested that these elements might have arrived on Mercury via comets or asteroids. But this wasn't the most astonishing discovery. Water ice was also found in shadowed craters near Mercury's poles. Since these areas remain in perpetual shade, they stay cold enough for ice to remain frozen. Dr. Nancy Chabot was part of the team that made this discovery. Furthermore, traces of organic substances were found in these craters. These dark patches could be made up of complex carbon molecules, the kind that might have helped make life possible on Earth. This suggests that Mercury might contain data about the origins of life in our solar system, even though it's in such a harsh environment. Another surprise is that Mercury appears to be geologically active, contrary to previous scientific assumptions. The MESSENGER mission found signs of recent volcanic activity, such as volcanic vents that appeared as small bright spots on Mercury's surface. Dr. David Roth from the Open University in the UK observed these features, which show that Mercury's surface is still changing. The planet's turbulent terrain, about the size of Texas, has a landscape of hills and valleys near the South Pole. Dr. Thomas Waters from the Smithsonian Institution believes these formations could be caused by strong quakes induced by the sun's gravity as Mercury's orbit changes. As new research builds on NASA's MESSENGER mission data, Dr. Amir Khan and his team from the University of Zurich found that Mercury has a solid core inside a liquid shell, much like Earth. However, Mercury's solid core makes up a larger portion of its total size, potentially explaining some of its unusual magnetic properties. These findings challenge our understanding of how planets form and evolve over time. One significant finding concerns how the planet's core is structured. Earth has a solid core inside a liquid shell, whereas Mercury's solid core is within a mostly liquid shell. Observations of gravity field changes by MESSENGER revealed a unique structure. Surprisingly, Mercury's solid inner core is believed to be about 1,600 miles across, half the size of its entire core. This is considerably larger than Earth's solid core, which occupies about 20% of Earth's core volume. Mercury's small yet strong magnetic field is influenced by this unusual core structure. Another fascinating discovery about Mercury's layers was made in 2012. 
Messenger found evidence of past volcanic activity, such as shallow depressions called hollows. These hollows likely formed as certain volatile substances evaporated from Mercury's crust, suggesting the planet once had a greater abundance of these materials than previously thought. In studying Messenger's data, scientists found further surprises beneath the surface, signs of an ancient magma ocean. This magma ocean may have significantly impacted Mercury's geological structure, shaping vast smooth areas, like the northern volcanic plains, that formed from massive lava flows early in Mercury's history. However, one of the most surprising recent findings was signs of nitrogen beneath the surface, detected in messenger data in 2022. This discovery hints that nitrogen might be a remnant of an ancient atmosphere, pushed underground by the sun's intense heat. This raises questions about Mercury's history, initial temperatures, and potential habitability. The discovery of water ice in craters at Mercury's poles is another mystery. Despite Mercury's proximity to the Sun, these craters remain in permanent shade, keeping the ice cold. Comets or asteroids may have deposited this ice in the last few million years. Dark layers, likely composed of organic materials, could also be remnants from comets or asteroids that impacted Mercury. These organic materials provide insight into how such substances spread across the inner solar system. Could these materials hint at past life? There are still many questions about this small, sun-scorched planet. What other astonishing discoveries might lie beneath Mercury's cratered surface? The planet remains as intriguing internally as it is externally, as shown by new research missions.